Lucy, what are you doing? It's half time. <laughs> Why do I get the sense that you're not taking your training seriously? I don't know. Because my trainer's too damn distracted. Mm. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Told you me and JD had it out last night. You damn near kicked my ass before it tore off. Being on B gives him too much advantage. So what then, huh? You saying you don't want to fight him? <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> I'm gonna fight him because it's the right thing to do. And I'm prepared to lose. And you need to be too. What if we got you some vampire blood? No way. It'd just be the ones. To level the playing field, then we could clean this pack up. I said no fucking way. I don't know what kind of experience you had with V. Have you ever known anyone on it? But it's not just a drug. It's like swallowing death. You take it, and you're dead inside. So is it even worth training? Probably not. Training hard, I see. It's a closed session. I asked J.D. about what you accused him of last night. You about him being a V-fiend? And what do you say to that? He looked me in the eye and swore on my son's grave it wasn't true. Respectfully, Martha, your son doesn't have a grave because y'all ate him. Don't get literal on me, Rambo. I'm gonna tell you a story. My husband was packmaster. When he died, J.D. was next in line. Not a wolf in this pack would have challenged him. But out of respect for me and my husband, J.D. desisted. Instead, he devoted himself 100% to my Marcus, to teaching him what only a he-wolf can teach. Are you gonna deny any of this? I can't. It's all true, but Martha... It's J.D.'s turn now. He has more than earned it. <laughs> Emma, sweetie, come here. He's on V, Martha. It's a lie. You can still buy out. Let's go get you something to eat. 